We're Chris and Beck from Salt and Charcoal. Today we're taking you boating with us around Exmouth. We're reunited with old friends and have a lot of surprises in store today, including fresh sashimi off the boat. Let's get into it. We are at the Tantabidi boat ramp in Exmouth WA and we are so excited to be back reunited with our German friends Agnes and Chris. We've seen them all over Australia and they have become our best friends. When we met them, we were in the Nissan Patrol with the rooftop tent. Now we've bought our four wheel drive bus and they have bought a boat. So we are all gonna go out on the boat, do some fishing and enjoy this beautiful weather today in Exmouth. So excited to go out on their boat for the first time. We are hoping to see whale sharks, humpback whales or manta rays. Hopefully we see one of them, or all of them, or maybe even dolphins, or a turtle. Who knows what today's gonna to bring, but we hope to see something exciting out there. Before we go, we've all got our fishing licenses so we can legally catch fish today. that way. He's caught a fish at the same time. Oh, oh. There's either one or two we're about to find out. Chris is droning under the blanket so you can actually see the screen in this glary light. <laughs> you got him? This is so exciting, oh my gosh. It's a hard moment to describe. We thought there was only a mum and baby whale, but seeing this whole pot of whales swim right by our little tinny was magic. Humpback whales are found in Exmouth between late August to October. They migrate here from Antarctica for the warmer, quiet waters to safely raise their calves. Snorkeling in the sanctuary zone. 
really strong, so we're getting a very good workout out here. Yeah, we're so good. It's so much fun. It's really good fun. <laughs> we're going spearfishing. The boys are getting suited up to go spearfishing at a coral bommy that Chris has just found. Fish on the radar, so we're good to go for a bit of spearfishing. But before they go, they're going to check what fish they can and can't spear. Alright, just don't shoot. Just don't shoot forward, Wait, I'll run you through that. Babe, hey, what's the spearfishing rule? Red, it's dead. Say that again. If it's red, it's dead. Because we've only just arrived in this area, Chris has given Chris the lowdown. There's strict rules about fishing and spearfishing in particular. So there's a lot of research to be done as a spear fisherman. I'm hopping in to film the guys spearfishing, but I'm new to this and with the visibility not too good, I got scared so I didn't last long in the water. That's your Chris. It's a big fish. Oh my gosh. All right, here. Wait, 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 wait. Get it in, it's you, it's a big shark. It's hectic under there. Like. Woo! Oh, I think it's spear o'clock. Spear time! <laughs> Thank you.